Welcome back to my videos. Today we are going to read the giver book chapter 2, book written by Louis Lowry. Let's get into it right away. All the things I do with my friend, Jonas pointed out, and his mother nodded in agreement. I always participated, of course, because as children we must experience all the, of those things. And I studied hard in, uh, in his school, as you do, Jonas. But again and again, during free time, I found myself drawn to the, the new children. I spent almost all of my volunteer hours helping at, in the nurturing center. Uh, of course, the elders knew that, uh, knew that uh, from their observation, uh, Jonas nodded. During the past year, he had been aware of the increasing level of observation in his school at recreation time uh, and during volunteer hours. Uh, he had noticed the elders watching him and the other 11s. Uh, he had seen them taking notes. Uh, he knew through, um, that the elders were meeting for long hours with all of the instructions that he had and the uh, uh, he and the other 11s had uh, had during their uh, years of school. So I expected it, um, and it was I uh, was pleased, but not at all uh, uh, surprised when my assignment was announced as nurturer. Pfizer explained, "Did anyone, uh, everyone, applaud? Even though uh, they were surprised?" Jonas asked, "Oh, of course." They, they were happy for me that my assignment was uh, what I wanted most. I felt very fortunate. His father uh, smiled. Were there any of the 11th disappointed? Your year? Jonas asked. Unlike his father, he had no idea what his assignment would be, but he knew that uh, some of them uh, would disappoint to him. And though he respected his father's work, nurture would not be his wish, and he didn't envy laborers at all. His father thought, don't, no, I don't think so. Of course, the elders are so careful in their observations and selections. I think it's probably the most important job in our community, his brother comment, uh, commented. My friend Yoshiko was surprised by her selection as doctor, father said, but uh, she was uh, thrilled and let's see if uh, there was angry and uh, I remember that uh, when we were boys, uh, he never wanted to do physical things. He spent all the recreation time uh, he could with his construction set and his volunteer hours were always on building sites. The uh, elders knew that, of course, Andy was given the assignment of engineer uh, and he was delighted. And we later designed the bridge that crosses the river to the west of the town. Jonas' mother said it wasn't there when we were children. So there were very rarely disappointments, Jonas. I don't think you need to worry about that. His father reassured him. And if there are, you know there will appear causes. But they all loved at that and appear went to a committee to study. I worry a little about Ash's assignment. Jonas confessed, Ash is such fun, but he doesn't really have any serious interests. He makes a game out of everything. His father uh, uh, chuckled, uh, you know, he said, I remember when Asher was a new child at the nurturing center before he was named. He never cried. He giggled and laughed at everything. All of, uh, all of us on the staff enjoyed nurturing Asher. And the elders know Asher. His mother uh, uh, said, they'll find exactly the right assignment for him. I don't think you need to worry about him. But Jonas, let me warn you about something that may not uh, have occurred to you. I know I don't think uh, about it until uh, after my ceremony of 12. What's that? Well, 
is the last of the ceremonies as you know after 12 the age is important most of us even lose track of how old we are as time passes and though the information is in the hall of open records and we uh, could go and look it up if we wanted to what's more um, what's important is the preparation of adult life and the training you will receive in your assignment i know that jonas said everyone knows that but it means his mother went on that you you move into a new group and each of your friends will you'll no longer be spending your time with your group of 11s after the ceremony of 12 you will be with your assignment group with those in training no more volunteer hours no more recreation hours so your friends will no longer be as close Jonas shook his head. Asher and I will always be friends, he said firmly, and they will be uh, still be school. That's true, his father agreed, but what uh, your mother said is true as well. There will be changes, good changes though, his mother pointed out. After my ceremony of 12, I missed my ch uh, childhood recreation, uh, uh, but uh, when I entered my training for law and justice, I found myself with people who shared my interests. I made friends on a, a new level, friends of all ages. Did you still play, uh, play at all after 12? Jonas asked occasionally. His friends replied, uh, no, sorry. His mother replied, but it didn't seem as important to me. I did. His father said, laughing. I still do uh, every day at Nurturing center, I play bounce on the knee and pick up room and hug the teddy. He reached over and stroked Jonas's neatly trimmed hair. The fun doesn't end when you become 12. Lily appeared wearing her nice night clothes in the doorway. She gave an impatient sigh. And this is certainly a very long private conversation, and he, she said, and there are certain people who are waiting for the comfort object. Lily, her mother said fondly, you are very close to becoming uh, being an eight, and when you are an eight, your comfort, uh, comfort object will be taken away, it will be recycled to the younger children, and you should be starting uh, to go off to sleep without it. But her father uh, had already gone to the shelf and taken down uh, the stuffed object. Uh, the stuffed elephant uh, with, uh, which uh, she was kept there. Many of the comfort objects like lilies were soft, stuffed and imaginary creatures. Jonas's uh, had been uh, called a beer. Here you are, Lily Billy. He said, I, I come and help you remove your hair ribbons. Jonas is in, uh, and his mother rolled their eyes, yet they watched affectionately, uh, affectionately uh, as Lily and her father headed to the, her sleeping room with the stuffed elephant and that uh, had uh, been given to her as a comfort object. And when she was born, uh, his mother moved uh, to her big uh, desk and opened her big briefcase. Her work ne never seemed to end. Even uh, when she was at home in the evening, Jonas went to his own desk and began, uh, began to sort out uh, his school papers for the evening's assignment. But his mind was still on December and the uh, coming ceremony. Uh, he, uh, the, uh, though he had been measured by the talk with his parents, he hadn't uh, the slightest idea what the assignment of the elders would uh, be selecting for his future or know uh, or how he might feel about it when it uh, about it when the day came. Thank you for watching. Have a nice day. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and share the video. Bye-bye, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye, guys.